When I give what peace is to the most high, Yahweh, Bashem, Yahshai, Bashem, Rakakwadash, when I give double honors to the elders that rule well, salutations to the Akiyam that push in out this word in truth and sincerity is Kwame Ashala Rada. But then I just small video, you know, outside of grinding, you know, trying to provide things honestly, you know, as the scripture say. Yeah trying to provide things honestly as best as I could you know doing a little foundation home. I don't know so you know it does be when you had to make the two ends meet and hustle try and make the money not to uphold yourself to the kingdom but yes cover your head you saw sort this of have it so hard you know but all that is part of the judgment and part of the um, part of the judgment and the punishment that we had to go through for disobeying the Mosai by the labor hard by the sweat of thy brow you understand so I just making a little small video as I doing it here just come to my mind you know actually it was in my mind long time to be honest but it just come to my mind so the first scripture I say I would with here is Romans 12 I just entered straight fast now but to get some precepts you know because it's expound to edify the brothers Romans 12 verse 17 he say we recompense no to no man evil for evil provide things honest in the sight of all man so now providing things honest all that is part of working for a penny all that is to glorify God so try your best and and provide things honest in the sight of all men you know like Tonight I live by him. I live by him honest. I ain't going out there and try to make to get anything quick. To get money fast. You understand? Sell drugs. You know? Rubber boy and I do you know, I providing all things honest. Three hour bar shame you were shy and I spread everybody out of being. You understand because even the scripture say what by doing this thing we're doing you're heaping coals on the on, on, on the enemy head for judgment so you have to try and provide things honest in the sight of all man the next scripture that really hit me is all right second corinthians 13 7 where it say here he says now i pray to power that he I pray to power that he do no evil, not that he should appear approved. Not that he should appear approved. Don't know what, I don't know evil for evil to say. I'll get it back. You trying to cast out judgment for your own self now. Trying to approve it. And this boy do matter how do him that. You understand? He will do him. You know? So he said, don't do no evil, not that we should appear approved, but that he should do that which is honest, do we be it as reprobates? Understand? Do we be it as reprobates in the enemy or these heathens? Understand? These heathens, even to tell our people, the Gentiles, even they, because we prepare as reprobates, as coffers, you know? Now we look at the DI. But the Most I say what I pray to Paul that he do no evil, but, but that he should do that which is honest. So do which that is, in, is honest in the sight of the Musa, you know what I mean? I read it is about. It's about prophesying the truth because at the end of the day, to be honest, greater will be reward by. The reward is not to seek nothing here. Or make every kingdom by you know and even before the truth I was always in my spirit you understand this is just a pass through for me I think the great um I met the great um Jim Reeves it's Jim Reeves right yeah Jim Reeves he says saying this world is not my own I'm just passing through and that true statement Understand until near how Bashem or Shai come and correct this place we just passing through. So the best we could do is live your life honest, push the wood, edify brothers, 
try and wake up the elect. And you'll get a great crown. You'll receive a, a, a greater crown. So it always embedded in me too, you know. Here is just a partial money. Whether I'm rich, whether I'm poor, whatever, stay the most I permit. You understand? It's just a partial for me. Even the scripture in, in Ezekiel, yeah, where you say what? A good name is better than a precious ointment. So living honestly will gain a good name too. And if you really want to go into it, to be in a having a good name is what serving the Lord. And that is just what it is. Serving the Lord, the Lord will shine. You understand? So I'll bust one more precept here because there's no matter when I start back. But they're coming for me, so. Yes, boss, our next precept here. I already touched my teddy that I was watching. I read in here. This is first Peter 2 12. Oh, yes, serious. This scripture is. Right, let's see if this scripture. They say, having your conversation honest among the Gentiles. So, even your conversation. Uh, to be honest, when you look at that word honest, so I'll go back to the. Um, Good cause, go back to the dictionary. It's a good and truthful, not lying, stealing, or cheating. So, your conversation has to be good. I understand? And I think I do a video at back. At back, I think it was with me and one of the brothers. Yeah, you can't be on the same two, the two you can't be on the same two third spirit as a two third. You are this light, you are this truth. So, if a two third want to give up. Oh, come again, say in the street, yeah. Wherever. You see, lay a conversation with you. One is good. You can't be in, 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 in a... in a... in a... in a... in a kind of... arrogant state now, boy. That way, you see, let be... honest. Showing... suggestion a good and truthful character. So, you're showing... or a sub showing or suggesting a good and truthful character because really when you're a shy walk even if you're, you're a shy this some of them but you didn't heights you did with them under heights you did with them under heights so even your conversation have to be honest as well as your works you understand as well as your works have to be honest. So I'll go back to the, the, the precept we say, First Peter 2, 12, having your conversation honest among the Gentiles, that whereas they speak against you as evil doers, so, and that is the same thing. They speak about the, 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 the thing we call the thing. They like to say that this can't be the way. You understand? Because of the truth coming out. But he said, make your conversation honest. Whereas they speak against you as evildoers, they may by right against you as evildoers, they may by your good works, which they shall be whole, glorify your Bashem in the day of his visitation. So by your good works, listening and that is what the most I say, let your conversation even be honest. Be live honest and I mean recompense no man evil for for evil. But honestly. So all that is part of working. So it's not only it's not only prophesying. Not only prophesying and going out there and doing the works. It's a complete thing, it's living good. Humility, that way I see humility is a very deep thing. Not being puffed up. It can't be being puffed up because if you already check it, honestly, worthy is the lamb boy. When you go and slaughter a lamb boy, think about it. When you go and slaughter a lamb, a lamb don't move boy. So there is the spirit we brothers had a being to buy. 
The pen if I toot it on a play buff and a pan come and up and you puffy side and thing. You can't be as a toot it, boy. You gotta be humble, boy. Greater is your word, boy. That's why you see having your conversation honest among the Gentiles that whereas they speak against you as a evildoers, they may by your good works, they may by your good works, which they shall be whole, glorify your Bashem or Shai in the day of visitation, boy. They will be whole, boy. I think it's our scripture in our wisdom, our Solomon, as it was done. I can't remember but I think they are my brother the bar on the ark. He used to say why they will they, they, they be holy strangers at their salvation. I can't remember the precept. But they will shock is Jesus the man by. So it, you glorify your hope of Hashem in the day of Visitation, they will have to be whole that now, boy. They will be whole that now, boy. So, you know, I just. In this video for edification's sake, I want to say all praises to your Hawa Bashem, your Shai, Bashem, your Kako, that salutation to the Akim that pushing up this word in truth and sincerity, risking your life to do so. It's quite me a shout out. Another video, I want to say shout out.